प्राइम फैक्टर्स ऑफ फाइव जीरो जीरो फाइव I can see this, so five can be multiplied with this number, so I can get one of the factors. So now I have got five, the first prime factor. So let's divide five zero zero five by five, and I get one zero zero one. Now we have to divide one zero zero one. So what am I going to do? I'm going to use the divisibility by eleven. So let's check divisibility rule of eleven. So the divisibility rule of eleven it says that the sum of digits at odd places minus the sum of digits at even places must be either zero or a multiple of eleven. So what I have to do now? So I have to check the number one zero zero one with this rule. So the odd places are. This one, the first place and the third place. So let's sum it up. One plus zero. This is one, and let's check the even places. That is this one and this one. These are the even places. So zero plus one. So now zero plus one that gives me one again. So let's subtract this, and I get zero. Since this condition is satisfied, so I can say one zero zero one is exactly divisible by eleven. So now the another prime number that I get is eleven. Yeah, and let's start dividing it. So now I'll take hundred together. So eleven times nine is ninety nine. What I'm left with is just one as a remainder. So the number left to be divided is eleven now. So eleven times one is eleven. So now the remainder is zero. Let's move to ninety-one and find its prime factors. So thirteen times seven is ninety-one. So now seven is left. Seven itself is a prime number. So seven times one is seven. So now I have got these are the prime factors of five zero zero five. So I can just sum it up here and write my answer. So five into eleven into thirteen into seven is five zero zero five. So these are the prime factors. So thank you so much for watching Maths Logical videos.